Hey everyone, so today I decided to do an e.l.f. haul. I ordered some stuff a while back and I got it, and so I thought I'd show you guys what I got. I've actually used most of the products too, so I can kind of give you a review on um, what I thought of everything. So it came in this big package like this, the pink stripes, which I think is totally cute. And then everything came in this, like, big bag of stuff, so. Okay, and then like the receipt and stuff is in here. So... Let's see. Okay, so the first thing I got, I reordered, and it's really funny because there's two things I wanted to reorder, but I got like so mixed up and everything, I only reordered one of them. So um, this first one is their their blush in Peachy Keen, which I absolutely love. Um, I'm sure you've seen it if you've seen any of my videos because I use it like all the time. Um, it's just a fabulous color. It's a gold kind of peach color and it has the gold flecks in it and it's just really pretty. I really like it. It's a really subtle color. So it's, I don't know, I really love it. So I got that and then I got um, their sharpener, their pencil sharpener, which actually comes with two of them and I've already used it. Um, you can kind of see their stuff in it. But this one has like a big one and then like a little one and that has like a little travel one that doesn't have a casing on it. This actually works really well. I was kind of surprised. Um, as to how well it sharpened, but it actually worked really well and for as inexpensive as it was, it's kind of nice. So, yeah. What's that little button do, I wonder? Hmm. Anyways, okay. And then I got, okay, so I got this, it's called an all over stick and the color is in light beige. Yeah, not too pleased with this, let me tell ya. Um, Looks like that, and the product is in there. It's like a cream um, concealer, I'm guessing. So that's what I use it for. Is um, it's creamy. It smells orangey, which I which I kind of like. It's like a citrus, but it's just such a mess. Like uh, I don't know. I could, in their defense, I could have just gotten a bad one, but it's just like you you twist it up like this, and like the product comes up, but then like. It doesn't go down all the way. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Um, it's it's a I don't know. It didn't stay on all that long. It was nice and creamy, but it just didn't stay on for me. Um, so I don't think I'll rebuy that. But I kind of wanted to try it just to see what was up with it. So um, then I got these lashes, and it's the Natural Lash Kit, and they look like this. They looked a lot smaller online. They're kind of big, but I'm kind of excited to try them. I'm gonna have to trim them obviously because I have really small eyes, and that would be kind of crazy. But it comes with um, black lashes and lash glue. Um, but yeah. Yeah. So that's what they look like. And then... Let's see. I got... Okay, I'll pick up this because I wasn't all that happy with it either. Um, this is their Shimmer Glossy Lip Shine. And I'm looking for the color... Oh, top. This is in Candlelight. It looks like this. And... I, I don't know how I, I don't know. Um, just kind of swatching it for you. That's the color. It's kind of an orangey color. Um, it's actually not a bad color on me. However, I don't know if it's the applicator or what the deal is, but like that hole right there, it like it scratches my lips when I use it and I'm not like all that fond of that. I don't know, call me crazy, but, um, yeah, so, I mean, it's, it's all right, it's got pretty good lasting power, but, again, like, just putting it on as, like, I'm sorry, like, putting it on is half the fun, and when, like, scratches your lips, it's just not all that appealing, I, I don't know, so, and then I actually got this, and I really like their packaging on this, it's a lipstick, and it's in Natural Nymph. So it looks like that and this is the color it's kind of a it's a nude color this is very nude <laughs> um i was looking for a nude but this comes out a little bit whiter on me and actually in my hand it comes out kind of pink but i don't know if that's even seeable it's right above the gloss but um i put it on and it makes me look kind of dead which actually is easy to fix you know with certain lip glosses i just use like a pinkier lip gloss over it and it, it fixes it fine um, it's pretty smooth um, and stays on well as far as that goes, 
but um, I wasn't all that pleased with the color. But I think I would. I think I will try more of their lipsticks just in different colors um, to kind of see because I feel like the formula is really smooth. So, which is kind of nice. But yeah, that's the packaging. It's kind of a cute like little box packaging, which is nice. Um, yeah. Okay. And then I have one, two, three, four, five more things. But I'll go quick. I promise. Um, I got this blending eye brush. Okay, so I have, okay, I had a blending brush that I got in a set with my Eco Tool stuff, and I absolutely love that blending brush. It was so amazing, and I can't, like, I looked everywhere and I can't find it, so I got this one. It's, um, it, it's, it's, it's nice. It's, it's just doesn't compare to the one because I loved it so much, but it's actually, it's, it's a nice, it's a nice brush. I also have their flat shader brush, which I really like, but it just looks like this and it's just, it's a nice blending brush. It's nice and soft. And so I, you can't complain too much about it, honestly, because it's, it does its job pretty well. Um, but yeah, I just kind of wanted to try out a, a different blending brush because I'm really sad about the one I lost. Um, and then I got, um, two liquid, um, liquid eyeliners. <laughs> um, one is in metallic olive and the other is in plum purple. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see these, but, um, it's like, that's the purple color and it, it shows up pretty true to color, I think. And this one is the metallic olive, which I expected this to be, I don't know if you can even see that, but I expected this to be a little more green than it was and it comes off a little more brown with like a green yellow shimmer on it. Which actually is kind of nice because I'd probably I'll probably use it more because it's more of a brown color, but it's nice. But um, I really love pencil eyeliners, but I cannot find a pencil eyeliner that will stay on me for the life of me. So I I um have a lot of like liquid liners that I've been using. So those are both really nice. They stay on really nicely. They're pretty smooth. Um, I like them a lot. So okay, last two things I wanted to try out. This is the um makeup mist and set. It's an aloe green tea cucumber vitamins A, C, and E. And there's like no directions on it or anything, but it's a setting spray. So like you put your makeup on and you spray this on and it's um, supposed to set your makeup. Um, I've only used it a couple times, so I can't tell you if I'm like totally sold on it yet. Um, I feel like um, with my eyes, obviously, because I use primers, they stay on pretty well. So I'm more looking at it to hold my base on a little bit better, which I, th I from what I recall, it does. I just haven't like sat down and really like paid attention. So, um, but I think that'll work really well, really well. And you can actually use it during the day too to like cool your skin, I guess, or like refresh your skin. So, um, but yeah, that's what that is. And it's just like in this little bottle, there is 0.2 ounces, two ounces. I feel like this is two ounces. Again, that's two ounces. But yeah. And then the last thing I got, um, I really want to try the NARS version of this. This is Blush Bronze, and it's their um, duo. It looks like this. And um, it's supposed to be really comparable to the Laguna Bronzer and the Orgasm Blush from NARS. Um, so I thought I'd try it and just see if I like the types of colors that are in it. I actually really like these. This particular one is really powdery, however. Like when you put your brush in it, it's just like everywhere, which is kind of typical for e.l.f. products just because their powders are a little bit lighter. Um, but yeah, they're really, they're really nice. They're smooth, um, which is, it's nice for what you're paying for it because they could be a lot worse, I guess. Um, but they're definitely worth trying because I just wanted to see if I even liked the colors. My, um, my one complaint, however, the bronzer is really dark. Um, I don't, Again, I don't know. See, like you can see, this is the blush up here and this is the bronze right there. That's like one swipe, maybe two. So it's really, really pigmented, um, which you can use different like stippling brushes and stuff to make it a little bit lighter. But I like, honestly, let me find a clean finger. Like that's one swipe of this stuff. <laughs> like it's just like, it's really dark. So um, if you have darker skin, maybe that would be such a big deal, but I'm, I'm a little bit paler. So it's, it's a little bit harder for me to use. Um, but I do like the blush. I do like the consistency of the, um, powders too. Like they're, they're a nice formula. So yeah. So yeah, that was everything I got my elf haul. I think for all of that stuff I paid, it doesn't even say on my receipt. I think I paid like $24, $26 for everything. Um, which is kind of nice, especially because I just like, I wanted to try a lot of the stuff just to play with stuff and kind of look and see what I liked. So 
Um, yeah, so that's everything I got, and I hope you enjoyed this, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.